if we were to get all or most or more students to complete high school, what would it cost and what would be the consequences? No other study really looks at the costs. They only talk about the benefits. Well, there are some investments where you have benefits, but the costs are higher than the benefits. See, so it's important that you look at both of these. And it's also important that we don't say, hey, it's cheap. It doesn't cost anything. Well, in the long run, it's cheap because the benefits exceed the costs. Costs of uh, increasing the numbers of graduates are very high, but it's not the, not the end of the story. The question is, what are the benefits in terms of additional income, tax revenues, uh, reductions in the costs of public assistance, public health, uh, criminal justice system, and so on? What are the additional savings in terms of criminal justice costs and so on. So that's what you have to weigh it against.